Good morning and welcome to DTV. It is Thursday, January 19th. My name is River. And I am Zach. This morning we shared our swim video from the awards ceremony. Congrats to the girls winners of the following awards. Hannah Zeal's MVP, Audrey Mathis Sportsmanship, and Rachel Mathis Most Improved. For the boys, Clay Daniels MVP and Tommy Kerwin Most Improved. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now for our Dolphin updates. This is for middle school students. Many of you are choosing not to report to the cafeteria in the morning and are hanging out near stairwells, doorways, or outside the media center. The library does not open until 7.15 and you may not get off the bus and just go upstairs. You need to report to the cafeteria and after 7.15 may go inside the media center. You may not go out on the field and begin throwing a football, etc. The positive reward for those students who are managing to stay tardy free is scheduled February 3rd. The list is already growing of students who haven't managed to stay tardy free in the short, short time we have been back in school. Remember, those who get five tardies receive the reward of detention. Time to check in on our campus birthdays. Happy birthday wishes to Emily Barrero. Today for lunch, the cafeteria is serving chicken parmesan. Now here's today's Project Wisdom update. Good morning, MHS. This is Ariana with a few words of wisdom. Someone wise once said, you are the master of the words yet unspoken. Once they are spoken, they are the master of you. What do you think that means? Who decides what words are going to come out of your mouth? Obviously you do, so you are very definitely the master of your unspoken words. And what happens after you speak your words? Someone hears them, and they respond to them. For better or for worse, he or she may even act upon your words or pass your words along to someone else. 
Now, who is in control of these words you spoke or perhaps texted? Are you in control anymore? They can be passed along and shared with anyone with a mouth or a click of their fingers. Today, take charge of those unspoken words and think before you speak or text. Remember you are the master of your words and be responsible for what those words produce in the world. With something to think about, this is Ariana. Make it a great day or not. The choice is yours. Thanks, Ariana. Remember that any students who wish to have a chance to read to the service dogs need to have your request in to your ELA teacher by tomorrow to be considered. Now for our sports update. Good luck today as the girls weightlifting travels to their regional meet. Also good luck to our Lady Finn soccer team who begin districts this week. Lastly, good luck today to the varsity boys basketball team who travels to the Heat Arena to play Key West and students who went get to the also watch the Heat. News here today on DTV. Have a